Hello all, this is John AE5X, and a few days ago, I think on May the 1st, Hands G0 UPL released uh, an update to the firmware that runs the QMX version 018. <clears throat> I haven't installed it yet. I'm still running 1.7, um, but I'm about to install it here. One of the things the upgrade is supposed to do is eliminate the thump on CW. And I'm primarily affected on 80 meters. Let me show you how that sounds. Again, this is with the older, the 017 software. <clears throat> Let's go up to 60. Pretty good on 60 as is. 40. I can hear it. I don't know if the camera is picking it up very well. It's definitely present on 40. Thirty sounds very good. And it's present on twenty. Okay, so again, that's version 017. Let me go off camera for a minute. I'm going to install the new firmware. And there's an option in that firmware to turn on a thump suppressor. I'm not sure what it's actually called in the menu, um, but I'm going to load the software and then go through the bands again without enabling that option. And then I'll enable it and go through the bands again, and uh, we'll see what the effect is. <clears throat> okay, I've now got 018 loaded. You'll see it here. And I've gone through the menu settings and changed the side tone, volume, and pitch back to close to where they were, if not exact. I've turned on AGC, and I've turned on the RF power meter reading and the battery icon, just like it was before. So uh, let's start, start out on 80 and see how it sounds. And again, this is with the audio thump suppression not yet enabled. And as you can see already, 80 meters sounds better even before we enable that feature. It's going up to the other bands. Well, they all sound better. Every band sounds better than it did before, and I haven't even enabled <coughs> enabled that feature yet. So, all right, let's go enable it and see what happens. Suppress thump. Change that to yes. All right, let's see what we've got now. Sounds way better than uh, 017 did, but it sounded good even before enabling the uh, thump suppression. Okay, it sounds great, um, even without enabling it. I guess I'll leave it enabled, um, and I'll try it out on the air. As you can see, I'm just going into a dummy load here, and I'll see how it sounds on the air, maybe uh, manipulate some other settings if I need to, but um, boy, the way it sounds right now, a vast improvement. Uh, night and day, night and day difference from before. 73, and thanks for watching, and thank you, Hans, for the update.